OMG, welcome back to my channel. So excited that you are here. Thank you so much for clicking on this video. I appreciate you. It's Jody Dunn. I am coming at you with a second rebate haul this week. OMG, I hadn't done one in forever. And now this week I'm doing two. I know the camera looks weird. I went to go grab my phone holder and look at, look at what happened. <laughs> I don't know how it got broke. So I got you propped up. It looks weird. You can see my steering wheel, whatever. Guess I gotta buy a new phone holder. Anyways, if you're new and you just found me, just still trying to see if I can fix it, forget it. Uh, so happy that you are here. Would you please say hello to me and let me know that you are new right down there. I would love to welcome you to the channel and say hello back to you. And if you are already subscribed, thank you so much for coming back to another video. So I got a $5 for 18 weekend warrior. I bought a rebate and then I got a $5 for 21, um, like spooky something uh bonus so at first i wasn't even thinking about completing them this today uh but then i found out about an awesome deal happening um that i ran over to kroger to do so we're going to be doing kroger and walmart today and completing both of my ibotta bonuses it should be pretty fantastic um what was I going to say? Oh, if you're new to using any of the rebate apps, I have tutorials linked down in the description box where I walk you through how to use that particular rebate app if you want to learn about that. And then all of my referral codes will be listed down in the description box as well. So today I'm going to be using, well, at Kroger, I used Ibotta, Kroger Cashback, and Shopmium. And then that awesome rebate I'm going to tell you about. And then at Walmart, I used Ibotta, Fetch, Shopkick, My Points. Is that it? That's it, I think. <laughs> Anyways, let's go grab some awesome deals. If you enjoy this video, make sure you give it a thumbs up. I appreciate you so much. Let's head into Kroger first, then to Walmart to grab some awesome deals. Happy Friday. We are in the Kroger. Thank you so much to Debbie who commented on my video. Let me know there was an amazing deal happening. So uh, I didn't know anything about it. I jumped on YouTube. I looked up TX Frugal Finds. I love her Kroger videos. And I am here to do this deal. So we've got the Progresso Soup on sale for 99 cents if you clip the digital coupon. And that is a limit of five. I think there was a manufactured digital coupon for $1 off four, but I hadn't clipped it and it wasn't available. So I'm going to go ahead and submit to Shopmium for a dollar coupon reimbursement back when I buy four of the Progresso soups. But I'm actually going to pick up five of them. Four of them are going to ring up for 99 cents. And then that um, I'm going to pick up six of them, excuse me. Five of them are going to ring up for 99 cents, and that sixth one is going to ring up for $2.19. The reason I'm picking up six is because in TX Frugal Finds video, she actually found 10 of them on clearance, and she ended up getting back a uh, $2 register reward or Catalina coupon. And so I just Googled if there was a Catalina promotion on Progresso Soup, and I found that if you buy six, you earn back a $2 register reward. So that's why I'm grabbing six. Well, there is also an awesome cash back reward uh, for purchasing 10 of the General Mills products, participating products. It's actually by five and you earn back ten dollars or buy ten products and you earn back twenty five dollars i'll leave the link down in the description box but it's homeappetiterewards.com and you can get paid through paypal venmo or you can choose a digital um like visa card it includes a lot of General Mills products, but not all. So definitely take a look at the participating products. I'm going to show you what I'm getting today, but there are other choices as well. So another thing I'm going to grab is, because uh, I only have six products with my Progresso Soup, I'm going to grab two of these Betty Crocker uh, fudge brownie mixes that are $1.69 each. And then I'm going to go ahead and grab two boxes of cereal, which, <laughs> bummer. 
I was in the store early this morning because Kroger is where I do all of my grocery shopping. Uh, but I usually do pickup orders. Anyways, I'm all out of Lucky Charms and it's EJ's favorite. And they're on the Mega, which this round of the Mega is buy three participating products and you save $2 off of each. So I had already grabbed two Lucky Charms earlier. I had a digital coupon for $1.20 off of two. I had a Kroger cashback rebate for $1.50 back when I buy two. And an Ibotta rebate for $1.50 back when I buy two. So these were a little moneymaker for me this morning. And I'm going to have to wait. I did this shopping uh, on Thursday evening. I'm going to have to wait until Friday morning to see if my Ibotta rebate resets. But in the meantime, since I already used my digital coupon and my Kroger cash back, I won't be getting that for this transaction. I'm going to submit to Shopmium for a dollar coupon reimbursement when I buy two of these. So as it stands right now, I have $14.50 worth of product here. I'm going to get $2 back in coupon reimbursements from Shopmium, a $2 register reward for purchasing six of the Progresso, and submit for that awesome rebate of buying 10 participating General Mills products and get back $25 in cash. It's going to make all of these products a $14.50 moneymaker. If my Ibotta rebate resets, it's going to make them a $16 moneymaker. I also have a couple bonuses on Fetch that I won't reach with this transaction, but I'll start tracking. And so anyways, this is such an awesome, awesome deal. You may already have known about this, but I did not. So I thought, let me go ahead and just share this quick little Kroger haul. And like I said, these are not the only participating products, so definitely check the list. But I thought this was pretty good to add to it also. But I already bought some of these with my pickup order. Uh, all the Pillsbury, or not Pillsbury, yeah, they're Pillsbury. Like the Crescent Rolls, the Cinnamon Rolls, they're buy one, get one free. And they would count towards buying the products. And we also have a digital coupon I think $1.25 off when you buy three or maybe a dollar off when you buy three. So just another option for you. In order to get the $2 off of each product, I need to buy at least three on the Mega. So I'm gonna go ahead and pick up this Safely Cleaner, which is on the Mega for $3.49. I'm gonna grab two of them. I'm gonna submit to Ibotta for a $1.75 rebate back on each. And then I have a Kroger cashback rebate for a $1.75 back on each, which is gonna make both of these totally free. I do have a Weekend Warrior on Ibotta for $5 back when I complete 18 offers. I'm not going to complete that, but I'll have like, I don't know, quite a few offers towards that if I want to complete it later this weekend. So while I'm here, I'm just grabbing a couple of other things. One of them is going to be these two good yogurt smoothies. They're on sale two for $3. I have an Ibotta rebate for $1.50 back when I buy two and a Kroger cashback rebate for $1.50 back when I buy two, making these totally free. And then while I was filming this part, I happened to look down and notice that one of uh, my girl's favorite yogurt smoothies was on the Mega for $2 off, and we just don't very often get deals on it. I have such a huge moneymaker, I'm gonna go ahead and grab a package of these La La smoothies for $2.49. I have no Ibotta rebates for these, no Kroger cash back, uh, no uh, coupons or anything, but I have a big money maker here, so I'm gonna go ahead and add these in as well. And then the last thing I'm gonna grab from Kroger is uh, these cat treats. I scanned these, it says they're four for five, but when I scan the little grillers, they're ringing up for 99 cents each. So I'm gonna grab five of these. So five of these is gonna be $4.95. I have a digital coupon for a dollar off of three. Then I have a rebate over on Ibotta for $1.33 back when I buy five. And then there's a rebate over on Shopkick for 150 scan kicks for each one up to three, which totals $1.80. It's gonna make all five of these just 82 cents. All right, so this is all I'm gonna grab from Kroger. And I did decide to finish both of my bonuses on Ibotta. Uh, so we're gonna head over to Walmart now and uh, do a whole nother rebate haul for this week. All right, we are in Walmart to finish out this rebate haul. 
Uh, so the tooth brushes are no longer attaching to that rebate on Ibotta, which is a bummer. Um, but I'm going to go ahead and grab these toothpaste for $3.96 each. I have $4 back on Ibotta when I buy two, and then I will submit to Shopmium for a $4 coupon reimbursement, just making these totally free, and it'll help me reach both of my bonuses. All right, I'm going to grab the Dove hand soap again, $3.97. I have a dollar rebate back on Ibotta. I have a dollar rebate over on Shopkick. And then a dollar back on Fetch when I spend four. And if you caught my rebate haul earlier this week, Fetch did not give me credit and I corrected my receipt. They did give me credit, but it took like, it looked like my receipt had already been corrected. Um, but just this morning when I opened up my Fetch, all of a sudden it was there. So anyways, I only need to spend 3.30 to get my next one. So I'm gonna grab it, it's my favorite hand soap. All right, next I'm going to grab this razor for $5.82. I have $2 back on Ibotta. And I already used my thing on Shopmium, but I'll submit to my husband Shopmium for $4 back. It'll make this totally free. All right, and then these are super useful, so I'm going to go ahead and grab these. Uh, the Tide to Go 6 count. They're in the Travel and Trial section in my store. They're $2.47. We have a dollar back on Ibotta, uh, so it'll make it $1.47. All right, I'm gonna grab Tom some more cat treats. I grabbed him the catnip temptations, the regular ones, he loves them. These are creepy, creepy catnip. Uh, they're 2.58 and I have a $1.30 back on Ibotta. There used to be a rebate over on Shopkick too. Uh, it's just changed to 19 scan kicks, so that's fine. Um, so I'm still gonna grab it for him. All right, I was super excited about this deal, but I didn't realize the yeah, iBotta rebate's only a limit of one, which is kind of a bummer, but I'm still gonna go ahead and just grab one because uh, the Fabuloso Lemon Scent is my favorite. So it's $4.47. Submit to iBotta for $1.50 back, and then I'll submit to you my points for $1.06 back for buying one. So it's gonna make it like less than $2, and it's my favorite cleaner, and we don't, most of the drugstores don't carry the lemon scent, so I'm going to grab it. Okay, I was just walking by because I was over here by the cat section. OMG, do I slurge and get this? Oh, I wanted to grab some other cat food, too. Dang it, I got to go back anyway. Look at these. <laughs> They're $8.58. It's got a little mouse in it and then two cat treats. Um, it's probably way overpriced. Anyways, I'm getting it. We got $3 back on Ibotta for this. And then just over $3 back on Shopkick for this. So it's gonna make it $2.58. All right, I'm grabbing it for Tom. All right, these are on rollback for $1.60 each. I can't remember if they were when they just came on Tuesday. Anyways, I got a 50 cent back when I buy two, so I'm gonna grab those. And my about a rebate reset on the Persil, so I'm gonna grab another one, $5.44. Use a $2 paper coupon, pay $3.44. Submit to Ibotta for $2 back. And then I think I have a dollar back now. The Shopkick rebate lowered. Um, so that'll make it 44 cents. I think I'll pop it up on the screen. All right, I'm looking for the Dave's Killer Brut Organic Snack Bar. I would think it would be over here. That says my store has it in stock, but my store moved. Most of the stuff that used to be in the checkout aisle, which is where it says it is, they moved it over here. And I'm not, I'm not seeing it. I'm going to keep on looking. Oh, here it is. They do still have some over by the checkout aisle, just not as much. So I'm going to grab one of these. Um, I'll try the oats and honey almond. They're $1.88 and I'll get back $1.99 on Ibotta. Z rebate. I'm going to grab a mac and cheese for a dollar and submit to I bought it for 20 cents back. Since I decided at kind of last minute to do this, I'm here later than I like to be and it's dang busy and I don't I do not like shopping at Walmart when it is this busy. I usually come first thing in the morning or I don't come. But here we are in early afternoon and it's busy as heck. All right, I'm super excited about this one. I saw this over on my friend Amber Steck's channel. Definitely go check out her channel. If you are not currently following her, the Hagen Das Butter Cookie Cone. She says these are delicious. I'm excited to try them. And I was so excited to see they had strawberry because I love strawberry. So I'm going to grab two of them. They are $6.48 each. OMG. I'll grab one of 
grab a vanilla and a strawberry. I'm gonna submit to Ibotta for $2 back on each. I'm gonna submit to Shopkick for a dollar back on each. It's a limit of three times that you can do it on Shopkick. I'm gonna submit over to Checkout 51 for a dollar 62 back on each. And I'm gonna submit over to My Points for $3 back for buying two. I'll pop the cost up on the screen. I think it's gonna be less than a dollar for both of them, which is fantastic. All right, I need 13 rebates to hit my Weekend Warrior and the new Spooky, whatever, bonus. That's $10 in bonuses. So let's see, I've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12. I have 12. I'm just gonna do a pay with Ibotta, which is a gift card purchase um, for 20 bucks at Walmart. That will count as a rebate redeemed and it'll help me hit both of my bonuses then. Let's head to the kitchen table. All right, here we are back at the kitchen table with this rebate haul. Here I was thinking last night I would just go do that awesome deal at Kroger, <clears throat> grab a couple of deals, and then I decided to run to Walmart today. Uh, there's Clarky. For any of y'all that like to see Clark, Clarky! He's not even going to turn around. Fine. He always misses when his girls are at school. Oh, is he? No. Okay. Anyways. Um, I had those two bonuses, the Weekend Warrior and then the other, I can't even remember what it's called. Oh, there he's getting up. Gonna go lay on the couch. <laughs> oh, there's his cute little face. Oh, all right. So anyways, did all this, two rebate hauls in one week. I haven't done a rebate haul in forever. Let's take a look at what I did at Kroger. So I grabbed... All of that stuff that I already showed you in the store, I didn't have any paper coupons. They were all just digital. And I paid $31.64. Uh, I submitted for that awesome $25 uh, cash rebate. And then the Catalina machine spit me out a coupon and the $2 register reward compliments of Progresso. I submitted to Shopmium for $2 in coupon reimbursements for the Progresso Soup and the Lucky Charms. And then $5 from Kroger Cash Back, which was for the Safely and the Too Good. And those two offers did disappear, which means they're processing, but they, it does usually take about 48 hours. And then my Ibotta rebate did reset this morning for the Lucky Charms. So I submitted my receipt to Ibotta for $7.83 back. And then also submitted my receipt to Shopkick for um, three of those Friskies Little Grillers for $1.80. So I paid $31.64 at Kroger and I earned back $43.63. So my Kroger haul was an $11.99 moneymaker, which is awesome. So I knew I was working with $10 in bonuses, plus had the $11, almost $12 moneymaker here. So I just went ahead and finished up and got some things I wanted to get. So here's my receipt for Walmart. I just used one paper coupon, which was for my Persil. $57.23 was what I paid. I did pay with a $20 gift card that I purchased because I wanted it to count as a rebate redeemed towards those bonuses. And then I just used my PayPal to have a card for the rest. So what I got back was $7.09 from Shopkick, $8 from Shopmium, submitted to my points. I got back $4.08, which was for the Hagen dazs and the um, Fabuloso. Submitted to Checkout 51 for $3.24 back. And then I submitted to Ibotta for a total of $22.49 in rebates and hit my two $5 bonuses for another $10 back. Now, when I scanned in my receipt, this is why it's super important to always check to make sure it'll automatically, you know, credit you and then you have to hit submit. It did not pick up this one. So I had to go into my list, add more offers, then scan that. And then it came back super quick. And then I did submit my receipt to Fetch Rewards and this time it picked it up and it gave me the dollar. I didn't have to correct it, which was awesome. So for Walmart, I paid $57.23 and I earned a total of $55.90, which means my Walmart cost was $1.33, but my Kroger was $11.99 moneymaker. So everything on this table ended up being free plus a 10 
$1.66 money maker, which is so incredible. Look at all the food items I got. So much stuff for Tom. Got my favorite Fabuloso. So anyways, it was, it was an awesome week this week for <laughs> rebate shopping. Super duper happy with how everything turned out. I hope that rebate helps you. For the buy 10 items, earn back 25. It's not only at Kroger, but it does list the participating stores just as it lists the participating items. So check it out. I didn't even check to see if it was available at Walmart. It might be, but it might be available at your local grocery store as well if you have a smaller grocery store other than a Walmart in your area. But check and see, maybe Walmart's included. So anyways, there you go. If you enjoyed this video, make sure you give it a thumbs up. I appreciate you so much and I'm gonna see you again soon. Bye.